Our next competitor in the NBA Talent Challenge, Josh Richardson, who took a music history of rock and roll class at the University of Tennessee. So while he's a big hip hop fan, he also likes the Beatles and the Stones and grew up playing the piano and the clarinet and his favorite pastime is doing what you're just about to see. What's up? My name is Josh Richardson from the Miami Heat. And when I'm not hooping, my off the court talent is spinning records. It was kind of easy to get into DJing because I care so much about music. Ever since I got into it, I haven't been able to stop. I spend a lot of time just digging through music, searching for new things to listen to, new genres. I'm very versatile in my musical taste. I don't even want to imagine what life without music would be like. I think he's one of the quickest learners I've ever seen in my life. My boy Yusuf, who's like my DJ mentor, he's teaching me how to like put effects into the mix. When you're that passionate about something, no matter how good or bad you think you are, you're gonna be good at it. I really could sit down and DJ for like three hours at my house. Like my friends will be at my house in the summer and I'll be DJing and they'll leave for a couple hours. And sometimes they come back and I'm still in the same spot DJing. This guy is DJing on the airplane. He's mixing on the freaking plane. No one does that. Honestly, I would love to do it after I finish playing. I love it. It's like one of the biggest things to me right now. Good DJ to me, they're good with the technicals, they're good with their transitions. You gotta keep your BPMs in sync all the time. You can't go from like slow to fast or fast to slow. Feeling the vibe of the room is also huge. There's a lot of different things that really go into it. All right, well that's enough talking. Now's the time to go downstairs. I'm gonna spin a couple records and let's see how the crowd feels it. To me, a good transition, first the two songs have to sound good together and then just really being able to match the beats. This is the transition I was talking to you about. Alright, now here's a little bit of scratching. I'm just learning how to do it, so I'm gonna get better. Hope you guys are feeling the vibe. I'm Josh Richardson, and that's a wrap for Miami. Are you uh, are you feeling the vibe? Well, I'm saying like a lot of the stuff he was doing like was like tutorial. Like you should have been more showing us your skills as opposed to telling us what a DJ do. We know that already. And then you didn't even do nothing. Well, Charles don't know it that. <laughs> <laughs> I've actually, Ernie, I've actually DJed for Snoop one time. We did a party yes. together. And what I noticed that when he was making the transitions, we didn't see the hand move over, which tells me that tape was already done. <laughs> ah, and then when oh. you scratch, and then when you scratch, I love having some on, experts here. Whatever side you're on, that's the hand you're supposed to use. Never and, supposed to cross. He's he's only <laughs> yeah, he's only I, DJed on stage three times. Yeah, yeah, clearly, I, ain't, yeah, I ain't never seen a DJ yeah. scratch cross handed like this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So how'd you kid Capri doing that? Yeah, I'm so going to say you're going, you're going first, Shaq. Right, I'm going to go, I'm going to go seven. Seven. <laughs> Who's going seven? Hey, man, you and Shaq. I, I, I will say this. I did like his transition thought process. That would, But the, he didn't do it. But he did I will say, I'm first generation hip hop. I, I know how to do oh, it. What the hell does that mean? That means I know how to go to a light post, unplug it, and put DJ equipment into right. the thing. I'm first generation. I oh, understand that. And that... We have a legendary, legendary hip hop artist in this, in here now, Busy B, one of the first pioneers right. of hip hop. Oh gee. And if I gave this guy more than a six on that, he might come up here and say, "What about Grandmaster Flash and yes. the Furious Five yeah. and Harlem World and all?" Yeah. No, I gotta give him a six. Yeah. Say I gotta that, give him a six. Gotta give him a six. Chuck I'm Green. sorry. I'm gonna give him a seven just because I don't want to. I want to be different than Kenny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, since you gave me such a hard time about my last two scores. I, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let you tell me what you think I should give Josh Richardson. I think you should give him, what did you give him, a seven or six? I think you should give him a five. <laughs> All right, I'll give him a five. Yeah, be different. He I ain't do, seen no can, fives he, yet. He could do my, he could do my oh. son's birthday party, but he can't do yeah. my yeah. all-star oh, bash. Oh, oh, he can't right. do the all-star bash. Yeah. He, and you get on me and you say he could do my son's he birthday could. party. He could, get away. Well, he could do my nine-year-old son, I get him moving. <laughs>